Hello, I'm Chief Justice Maureen O'Connor. For more than 30 years, the Ohio Center for Law-Related Education's high school mock trial has offered a fun and innovative way for students to learn about the law and how our legal system functions. Guided by teachers and legal advisors, mock trial students participate in a simulated trial created for the program each year by volunteer attorneys. Students build interpretation, critical thinking, and public speaking skills when they argue their case in real courtrooms. I've asked Ohio State Bar President Jonathan Hollingsworth to explain this year's case. Thank you, Chief Justice O'Connor. This year's mock trial case involves a high school selling naming rights of its stadium to a corporate sponsor in exchange for funding renovations to the field. In protest, students organize into a group called Occupy. The school district responds by installing security cameras, searching the lockers of the students involved, and removing Occupy flyers, as well as filing an action seeking a temporary restraining order to remove the students from the field. The students counterclaim, contending that the school district has violated their constitutional rights and seeking their own temporary restraining order to prevent the school district from searching lockers and prohibiting students from meeting or posting flyers on school property. This case will give students a greater understanding of the First and Fourth Amendments to the United States Constitution. Mock trial state finals will be held at the Ohio State House in March, with the winner advancing to the national competition in Madison, Wisconsin. Mock trial is a terrific way to engage students, and here's the great part for teachers. The program aligns with Ohio academic content standards for social studies and English language arts. If you're not already involved, Jonathan and I encourage you to contact the Ohio Center for Law-Related Education to see how the high school mock trial can be a useful experience for your students.